Hey, what's up everyone? It's me, Frank, and welcome back to Cookies and Cream. Today I have a new addition to my collection. It's an 1882 $100 gold certificate. Now, this is an extremely rare note. According to the website Tracking Price, there's only 30 known for this Freeburg number. And here's the interesting part. Out of those 30, three of them are located in the Federal Reserve Bank of San Francisco, and another one is in the Smithsonian Museum. So that leaves just 26 available for collectors. If you think about it, that's pretty insane, man. This is a very rare note. It's graded by PNG, pick money guarantee, and it's graded 15, choice fine. This note features Thomas Hart Benton, born in 1782. He was an architect and the United States Senator from Missouri. He also served as an aide to Andrew Jackson during the War of 1812. One thing I should note is during that time, Andrew Jackson wasn't yet the president. Instead, he was the general of the United States Army. The president during that time was James Madison the fourth president of the United States. Andrew Jackson wouldn't become president until 1829, and he was the seventh president of the United States. So Thomas Hart Benton, he died in 1858 and was nicknamed Old Bullion. Now let's take a closer look at the note. There have been deposited in the treasury of the United States $100 in gold coin, payable to the bearer on demand. Department Series, Washington, D.C. Let's take a look at the back. So it says minor repairs. So you can see it's a, a little bit dirty. But despite the dirt, it still has some nice color to it. And by the way, that's what I like about these large size gold certificates. They all have this nice bright orange color. Unlike the small size gold certificates from 1928. Fantastic color. Here you can see an eagle. Magnificent creature. Alright guys, that's all I got for today. Stay tuned for my next money videos. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.